group field trip with some friends. Um, we are on our way now out to Beaufort, North Carolina, which is um, on the east coast of North Carolina. We're about an hour away. Um, we're going to take a ferry boat over to Sand Dollar Island and learn about sand dollars today and um, maybe be able to find some and bring a souvenir to you back home with us. So we wanted to bring you guys along to show you how beautiful it is out there and um, give you some info in case you're ever in the area and are looking forward to um, booking this excursion for yourself.
cover them with dirt or with the sand, and then when the water comes back in, they'll be they'll be all right. Goodbye. She's definitely alive. I touched this tail. It's so good. Yeah, he's in there. Good. You can't get him out. Okay. Oh, I can. I think I can get him. Yeah, he's alive too. Oh, is he? Yeah. There's two of them. Go here, buddy. I buried that one. We shouldn't move them. Yeah. Maybe they're borrowed for a reason. Yeah. Like Try and get them some more. Then you can swim back out when the tide comes in. Yeah. I buried the other one. Let's put the bag. Let's get our stuff set down. We were just reflecting, some of us moms, how amazing it is to have the freedom to homeschool our kids to where we can do this on a Monday. Um, this is something that public school kids aren't doing. And this is something that we get to take advantage of living so close to the coast and in such a beautiful, beautiful place, we get to take advantage of these these days and these times and make these memories together. And I'm just really thankful and excited for that. Look! You can see so all the little cool. things moving. Yes. So cool. You gonna put him back? <laughs> it has to go back in the water. Let's put it back right where we found it. I was trying to hold it and contain it. Oh, she got the little baby. Look at my fingers. Look, there's a tiny crab, little tiny crabs on there. I've been holding them. Oh, that's so cool. That's neat. Aren't they so oh, cool? Hello, honey. Here you go. Let your mama get a picture. Oh, yeah, he's in, he's in there. He? 
Yeah, he is. Look at all like the barnacles and stuff. Oh, wow. Look at that. I know. That's that is crazy. Yeah, I thought this was his legs. Like wow. when you see them at like the Myrtle Beach yeah. stores. But he's in there. I thought it was a piece of human anatomy. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> You found a lot of sand dollars. Yeah. But we were thinking, since we did it in like a full one, we could like glue, with hot glue on it and try to make a big one. Yeah, that's a good idea. Then you could have a whole one. Uh-huh. Yeah. But we probably found more than a whole one. And he loves it. Helen, what was your favorite part of Sand Dollar Island? Swimming. Swimming? Stop recording, please. Helen, <laughs> <laughs> don't be dramatic. Did you have fun? I don't like What was your favorite part? Swimming. Swimming? You're a good swimmer, huh? Swimming. Oh, <laughs> what was your favorite part? Um, Sand Dollar just Island. Just chilling there, eating. <laughs> eating. <laughs> eating. Did you guys find Sand Dollars? I found one. I found him. Where's your favorite part? Oh, come on. You guys too cool for this or what? I already asked you. I didn't ask Lainey. What was your favorite part, Lainey? Swimming and finding sand dollars. You found a bunch. How many did you find? Do you know? I think I found maybe 10. Like a live one? Yeah. A bunch. I'm just going to get on my face. Here. Face off. Are you mad? Miss Brooke? What was your favorite part of Sand Dollar Island? Um, getting to see my friends. Yeah, that was cool. Mm -hmm. Did you find any sand dollars? Um, I found a lot, but not any dead ones. They were all alive. And well, I found this little, like, cove area, I guess. And I counted. There was, like... 17 something sand dollars Jeez. and they were all alive the biggest one was like that big and then the little one was like like a quarter yeah all right we are back in the car on our way back home what do you think of sand dollar island highly recommend yeah it's a good time Everybody that went said that they really enjoyed it. It was just a perfect day as far as weather goes. Um, we found lots of sand dollars, uh, mostly live ones, 
but we did find a handful of the dried ones, so some lucky people got to take some home as souvenirs. But um, that's really it. We hope you enjoyed this video. Hopefully it was some nice scenery for you and gives you an idea of what to expect if you do decide to take this little excursion. If you're ever in the Beaufort area, um, definitely go check it out. That is it for today. We will see you guys on the next video.